coming up on Kylie Makes It, we make Sharpie watercolor art and some good memories. And Marcia. Hi. And this is Marcia's art studio. Look around! This place is beautiful! Marcia, what kind of art do you make? I make beaded wall hangings. I take all these different colored beads, I hang them, I, I put them on the strings, and then I hang them up together to make can different I, Can designs. I touch the beads? Yes! Look, all these little little strings have individual small little beads on them. And she strings them on these strings so that they make this whole picture. Isn't that Look amazing? At this one. I know. Is that your favorite strand? Marcia, how long does this take you to make one of these? So long. Yeah. Very, very long. Many hours. But I like it. So you bring your beads outside and you work here at this table? I do. Oh, that's amazing. It's my favorite. I hear the birds, I see the bunnies. So, so nature fun. inspires your art? 100%. That's awesome. Marcia has some sons and I have a son. And so we decided that we were going to do a project all together. It's a project that Marcia has done before. What is it called? Sharpie watercolor. Sharpie watercolor. So it's kind of a color and a paint, right? Yes, exactly. <gasps> Dax, are you excited? Okay, so the first thing that we're gonna do is put some fabric onto the canvas. Dax, we are going to make a big rectangle out of these pieces of wood. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Let's compare. Hmm, which one is taller? This one. All right, we're going to put the two short sides on each end like this. Then we're going to put the long sides down here and build it into a... Rectangle. You're right, a rectangle. Look at this cool frame. It's like we're in a picture. You want to get in our picture? Come on, Dax. <laughs> Perfect. Now that the frame is together, yeah. we're going to lay our fabric down flat. Make it nice and flat. The first thing we're going to do is open up our staple gun. This is something for adults only. Got it? Okay. Our canvas is done! We staple it all on the back so it's nice and tight now. Let's get our kits going. Come on. Okay, Marcia, what's the first thing we do? Well, you pick the colors that you want to put on your canvas. Like that. <laughs> and you start coloring and that's it. You just start. You can color anything you want? Anything you want in any color. All right. Let's do this. While we start, let me introduce you to these friends. This is my friend, Josiah, and this is Aiden. And we're about to make something incredible. It doesn't even have to really be a shape. You can just do colors or squiggles. There you go. Well, I like it. It's gonna turn into something really interesting. Why? All right. Ooh, Dax, what did you draw? I'm still doing it. Oh, okay.
a, a red, maybe a sheep. <laughs> Do you think? Oh, Dax is doing a red balloon. Dax, that balloon is awesome. If you put the rubbing alcohol on, it all kind of... I like that just like Marcia's art with all the beads, like all the little beads make this whole picture when they're one thing, all of us are drawing our own thing and it's gonna be one amazing art piece. Okay, is there any I can reach for you? Okay, what colors do you need that you can't reach? Yellow. Okay. Purple. Sure. And yellow. Another yellow. Awesome. Dax, what do you think I'm drawing? Um, what does mine look like? Dax! <laughs> can I draw some? You sure can. Oh, Dax, that's so great. I see the circle and then the straight lines. The wacky fun. Oh. I love it. <gasps> look at Aiden's son. It has curly hair. <laughs> Josiah is putting his marker like this. I see it on its side, so it gets wider like that. That's a cool idea. And then if you put it right on the tip, it makes a skinnier line. And you can just do a dot, <gasps> and if you leave it there, it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. Mm. Let's try it. That one is It, the bigger it gets. That's cool. I'm gonna do lots of dots too, Dax. Ooh, sunrise or sunset? I don't think it matters. <laughs> <laughs> I have a crazy idea. Yeah. What if everyone stops? Oh, crazy. And we turn it, and you have to keep drawing on somebody else's drawing. That's a great idea. Okay, ready? Let's do that. Ah, yeah. Do it, do it, do it, do it. All the way. Not gonna fit on the <laughs> yeah. Okay. Look at this yellow. That was a good dot. It was That is a really good bowling ball. Max, are those bowling pins? Mm. What else can I add? I made a tiny bowling ball. Oh, I love that. It's going to get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Do you know the <laughs> reason? I don't. Bigger and bigger and bigger. <laughs> it just got big enough. Oh. Whoa. How? Na, 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 na. Look, Daddy's making art with He's us, too. Oh, yeah. yeah I know. the next part of our project. Marcia, what do we do now? Now, this is really my favorite part. Okay. When you spray the rubbing alcohol, 91% okay. or higher, um, the rubbing alcohol will make the colors kind of spread and kind of move together and make it look kind of like a watercolor. All right. Do part of it, I wanna see, yeah. Okay, let's do it. Give it a minute and it will start to move. Oh, I see it. I see it spreading right here. Yep. And sometimes you can get close and kind of make it move a little more. Wow. You can do a lot of different ways. 
I'm gonna do this black and blue over here and see what happens. I love this. Should we let the kids spray a little bit? I think they want to. <laughs> okay. You can spray like crazy. Oh, cool. Dax, look how the color is spreading where you're spraying. Amazing! Marcia, thank you so much for teaching us this incredible way of drawing and painting. Do you think that I could take this home? Yes. Yes! It's yours. Okay, I'm gonna pack it up, put it in my car, and we'll go back to the studio. I'm back home at my studio. Wasn't it fun to look at Marcia's studio? Different kinds of artists make different kinds of things, and so they need different places to make it. I love her bead art, and I love this Sharpie watercolor painting that I was able to make with my friends Marcia and Aiden and Josiah. And, of course, you too. <laughs> I love it so much. Do you have a favorite part? I don't even know how I would pick. Hmm. When you were looking at your favorite part, did you notice that some of this painting seems to be missing or that it looks a little bit smaller in my studio than it did in Marcia's? If you did notice that, you're right. This painting is exactly half the size that it was there. Want to know why? I split it in half! That's because the best part about making art is sharing it. And we all made this art project together. It was a great time and a great memory. So I'm gonna hang this one on my wall and I'm sending this one to Josiah, Aiden, and Marcia. Be looking for a package, y'all. I had so much fun creating with you and with them. And you know what? If you have some friends or family who wanna make an incredible project together that all ages can participate in, this is a great one. All you need is fabric, Sharpie markers, a canvas or canvas stretcher, a staple gun, and some rubbing alcohol, at least 91% in a spray bottle. That's it. Then you just need togetherness and your imagination. If you wanna make more art with me, I would love to make more art with you. Just search for Kylie Makes It, K-Y-L-E-E, -E. that's me. If you're a teacher, a parent, or a kid looking for more art to do, check out kyliemakesit.com for lots of fun stuff. I'll see you next time. I'm doing it too. Okay, good. Are you filming Kylie Makes It? Yeah. Action. Big one. <laughs> <laughs>